Yo, what up, what up, guys? It is your boy, and welcome to Docker Gamma. This is my third time recording this. My first two attempts ended with my game crashing. After the second time it crashed, I just said, F it. I was going to chill for a little bit and try to figure out the issue and try to fix it. Took me probably about an hour to actually fix it. The other time I spent not playing, I was just chilling and mentally regaining. But we finally fixed it. We found the issue and I was able to get it all fixed up and whatnot. So uh, yeah, we're back. And the only reason I decided to just not start a brand new playthrough was because we found an incredibly good find off the rip and I really really did not want to start over and try to have another great start because uh, finding a shotgun like this is very rare and very good indeed early game so from previous or from my previous recordings, I am not really going to go into too much detail about the differences between Stalker Gamma and True Stalker. Or Base Stalker, at that. If you guys have any questions, then I will cover them in the next video. Uh, just post your questions down in the comments below and I will answer them in the next episode. But, uh, yeah, for the most part, I'm just going to be playing and going towards my goal, which is going to be to, uh, you know, finish the three main storylines for this character. So, yeah, we've done a few missions. We have haven't done too many. Like, this is probably a 10-minute playthrough that I've done on this one so we are not far at all uh, I think our goal that we did have set was to go up to the farm and deposit all this stuff in the stash over here so I think that's what we're gonna do really quickly we'll head up there deposit all our stuff and then progress on and hopefully not have any more crashing issues I think I've crashed probably five times but the error was the same each time and the issue was with the Winchester file I believe I believe in the uh, last patch they added in the Winchester into the game and I guess it wasn't correctly finding that file or loading it or whatever the issue was so I just manually looked up the mod myself on ModDB and uh, redownloaded it and uh, unpacked it in the mods folder for Gamma started it up and uh, it's been working fine since uh, I don't know if it fully fixed the problem but the last few times I tried to load up the save it just instantly kept crashing with the same Winchester error so uh, it didn't do it this time so I'm assuming I fixed it or I delayed it oh god do I have? I have hollow points in. And I just switched my ammo. Sick. Hold on. My man over there praying it doesn't rain. I too am praying that it doesn't rain right now. I just want to get to the farm, offload the stuff, and carry on with my day. Thankfully, those uh, 
flushes won't cause too much of an issue for me. There's lots of fighting going on over there at the checkpoint. I would assume it's loners and bandits going at it. Those are the only two factions that are over there. Or that are usually over there. There was a time a few patches ago that I encountered the mercenaries and exosuits coming down that way. <laughs> And uh, a lot like now, I was very undergeared and a very fresh player. So uh, let us hope that that is not the case again. But they have patched that to where guys in exosuits don't come down here anymore. Or are less likely to come down here, I should say. Because there's always the possibility that they will come down here again. Uh, just offloading all this stuff real quick. Disassemble that. Disassemble that. Disassemble that. Because that'll be good stuff in the future. Okay. We'll offload that as well because we don't really need it. We are still pretty overweight. What is weighing us down so much? Probably our ammo. I'm going to assume it's our ammo. Alright. Now that that is done, there should be another jerry can over here. Yup. Quick tip for anybody who is uh, new to Stalker Gamma. If you uh, spawn in at the Rookie Village and then come up here, there will, there will always be two jerry cans one right there behind the first car and then one over here on the wall <laughs> they were always spawned there on new playthroughs always 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 so and they are very good items to uh pick up off the rip because they uh are very great for cooking food and whatnot speaking of cooking food Let's see if we can uh, cook some right now. I know you can cook food with just campfires now. Uh, let's see. I don't exactly know how to go into the cooking menu though, in order to like start start the process. But regardless, we're gonna save. And I will just figure that out later. We have a few more quests to do. We have that one, which is a bandit, so we gotta go kill that dude, but he is currently fighting. I would assume he's fighting mutants. So, go see if we can catch him off guard. We'll use FMJ rounds because they're bandits and they should be lightly armored. Oh shit. He's up there by the tree. He's down. Oh shit. The other one just got knocked down too. Hopefully I have enough ammo for this. I don't know if that dude's actually dead or if he just got knocked down. Ooh. Okay. We are also hungry and... Oh my god. Where is this guy? There's two of them. Can't get a line on this guy. Oh my god. I lit him up. He's down. We're not bleeding, but we are. Oh my god. We are in a rough spot. We're gonna go ahead and pop a med real quick. 
to try to keep us in this fight. I think I saw him. Bless, brother. Alrighty. That should be all of them. Oh my goodness gracious me. Alrighty. Let's, uh... Do we have anything? Oh, I really don't want to use IB, ibuprofen right now, bros. I really don't want to... Uh, we have four charges. Three charges in it. F it. Let's pop it. Okay. Uh, we will also go ahead and eat and drink. That's a new animation. I just hella chugged that. Ooh, that is in that very poor condition. Oh, bro. We're taking that scope. Uh, we're just gonna leave that there. As sick of a gun as that is, it's just not worth the hassle of trying to repair it. Alright. Take a look around, see what there is to loot. Those boars dipped off, which is nice. Really wasn't trying to deal with those boars. Could be a bandit up here that died somewhere. Ah, oh, here he is. Ooh, there's the Winchester. Here's what was causing my crashing. And it was probably causing my crashing because this dude had one. But we got it all fixed. And there. Yeah. Man, that thing looks clean. Not really digging the uh, hammer being in my way, but you know, I guess it is what it is. I don't have my inspect on. I'm gonna have to uh, fix that later on. Nice. Or that. The Winchester probably doesn't have a inspect animation yet, since they just added it in. Does this one have one? I don't know. The inspect animations for this game are pretty nice for the ones that they have. I mean, they're not too crazy. You're not taking out the mag and flicking them in the air and catching them and stuff like that, but it's just nice to look at the guns in this game. Alright, so we're going to hold on to that Winchester because that is in pretty decent condition. Uh, we're going to offload that. Offload. Or actually, hold on to that. We can sell that for a decent amount of change. Put that in there. Put all that in there. That in there. That in there. I need two more bandit patches. Then we should be able to turn in that quest. And we'll drop those two. Actually, what am I doing? There's a mechanic here. I can just sell that, dude. Sell it to that guy. So, let's go ahead and go through all of these. See what we're going to be selling and what we're going to be keeping. Uh, I think 65 and up is what we want. So, anything that isn't above 65, we are going to sell. Because at this point in the game, it is beyond our capabilities of repairing the parts. Jim. So, we'll sell that. And we will sell all of these. We have 1700 for that. That's not too bad. It's not too bad. And then, we're going to buy one of these. Can I buy any of these? I can buy one. Nice. 
Having a multi-tool is very, very nice early game. Because that means you can dismantle weapons and armor and get the parts that they have without the risk of reducing the durability of the part. Uh, let's eat some veins or whatever the hell this is. Nice, nice. Coming over here to sell this deck of cards because we don't need it. We have improved our stamina to level 2. This mod, oh, excuse me, does have a skill system, which is really cool. And they just add little bonuses to the game that you can just passively level up. So it's, it's just a nice quality of life add-on that they have. And it just kind of keeps you playing in a certain sense. So, before we press on... We're going to save. I need to get good about saving. The reason why I'm coming back to this campfire is because in the Gamma mod, you are only allowed to save next to campfires. Or in safe zones. So it really makes it to where saving is a must before going out and doing whatever it is you're going to be doing next. <coughs> Excuse me. Uh, so, this should be the last section for our spring cleaning, spring cleaning quest. The spring cleaning quest is pretty much the same. Uh, you'll basically just run through the map and just clear bandits from the entire map. And then turn it in. <laughs> Uh, I'm very low on ammo, which is not good, but we are broke at this point in time, so we're just going to have to make do with what we got and go to semi-auto and pick our shots carefully. Those are flushes, okay. Those are not flushes. We need a flush to pop out. Oh my god. Oh, you gotta be kidding me, bro. Oh my goodness gracious. Well. Welcome to Gamma. That is not my first death on this playthrough. Our other death was also to a boar. So, right now, boars are our mortal enemy, it would seem. Alright. We go again. We go again. Uh, I don't know how much I will edit out of this series I will probably just edit out obviously the unwanted stuff just me running from point A to point B if I'm not talking or nothing exciting is happening I'll obviously cut out the section so you guys don't have to deal with it Seriously, missing all those shots. Come on, I'm not scared of you. Okay, we are now a lot farther than we currently were. 
Now we are going to switch to FMJ rounds. I think we'll stick with semi-auto. This campfire is lit up. Usually campfires aren't lit up unless NPCs light them up, so you gotta be careful. We're gonna save real quick. I think they heard me walking up. Maybe not. I need to toggle my crouch button. He's down. He is not the only one here. The rest of them are inside. This dude's standing at the front door or something. Alright, we're gonna reload. Switch to full auto. We are going to start making our way inside. Oh, yeah. He's down. Alright, that's it. Nice. <laughs> that was relatively easy. I will take it. We just got enough patches to turn in that quest, which is righteous. Yeah, the AI will go. The AI will get stuck like that sometimes. Not all the time, but uh, sometimes they will. And it is very nice whenever they get stuck. That means I can just go in there and. Clear it out. Dirty barrel. Let's disassemble that. We'll take. We'll take that barrel. Take all that. Hmm. We'll take the rest of that too. Why not? Sell it for some moolah. All right. Save up here, head back to the farm, offload some stuff, sell some stuff, and then head back to Ricky Village and turn in these quests. And then proceed on with the next set of tasks. Jesus. Cat just came in guns blazing, bro. Oh, yeah. Alright. I think we gotta kill a mutant down there, south. Should we go do that first? How much ammo do we have? Not enough. Not nearly enough. We'll turn these quests in. Buy some more ammo and then we'll go kill that one. AK. Oh. <coughs> AK is so funny. 4K? That's not too bad. Alright. Now we need to buy some ammo. 13k, buy 45 of those, buy 
75 FMG. Um, Six K for a headlamp. Mm, I would like to get a headlamp pretty early on, but you know, it won't always be uh, available for me. Let's see. Four K. Mm. Buy some binoculars too. Having binoculars will be nice. It'll give us an edge on uh, looking for some stuff. All right. Let's refresh our task board. See what we got. More mutants, sure. Clear the research area and the garbage, we can do that. Search and rescue in the garbage, we can do that. Chimera horn, nope. Flesh hide, we can try that. Monolith faction patches, yeah, alright, bro, you're high. You are high. Alright. I believe we got a stash and cordon from turning in one of those tasks. Uh, no, could have sworn we did. Слушаю тебя. Guess not. All right, what? Well, we have a dangerous mutant over here that's actually headed its way. Don't know what kind of mutant it is. Hopefully, it's nothing too crazy. Before we go out there, though, we're going to save. Yeah. So, you gotta be careful with uh, where you're aiming your gun because the NPCs will be on guard and they will see it as a threat if they don't know you too well. So, it's usually good to. Put your weapon away when you're going inside of camps and stuff like that. Nice. Just a little pseudo dog. Nothing too crazy. Easy money. Easy money. I gotta talk to. Is it no, you? Привет. No? What the hell? You? No? Oh, of course, it's the last guy I check. What jobs do I have for you? Can I complete the job? Search and rescue? No, I can do that. Can I complete the job? Flash hide. Wow. That is, that is extremely more brighter than what it used to be. Jesus Christ. Those used, those didn't used to flash this hard, but uh, they do now. They do now. All right. <coughs> we'll go. Eliminate the mutant threat from up there. And then from there, we'll head back up to the farm, offload some stuff. We'll head over to the meadow, grab that stash, head back, and then head up to the garbage. And once we come back from the meadow, we'll grab our all the mutant parts that we've gathered so far. Take them with us. Because the garbage is home to a trader known as the Butcher. And the Butcher will pay way more money for mutant parts than any other trader. So, 
it's good to loot the mutant parts and then take them to the butcher. Whenever you are uh, crossing through the garbage. Make a little bit of do. I am on autopilot right now. I ran right past the uh, objective. Uh, should we save? Nah, we'll be alright. I think we'll be alright. I hope we'll be alright. Only one way to find out. Oh, we got dogs, I think. Is that a snork? It is a snork. It is not a snork anymore. It is another snork. The other snork is now dead. Oh my god! Jesus Christ! Oh. Okay. That dog had a very weird shadow bug. I did not, or it's just really, really dark. I did not see that thing until the last second. That scared the shit out of me. Oh my goodness gracious. Oof. Oof. We are just gonna sit here for a second and uh, heal up and uh, regain composure. Alrighty. So for those of you, once again, new to Gamma, campfires can in fact heal you over time. They will heal your overall health, which is the uh, human figure icon on the bottom left of your screen. It will not heal limb damage though, so keep that in mind. In order to recover limb damage, you must first pre-heal using medication and then post-heal. So, as you can see on the first aid kit, the orange uh, dots indicate that this will pre-heal certain limbs. It'll pre-heal my head and torso more than my arms and legs. And then to fully recover it, you'll have to use an item with post-heals such as ibuprofen, which will heal my arms and legs only, not my head or, tor or tor torso. So, to get the exact uh, indication of what, e of what each med will do, just hover over it and it'll tell you what it does. So yeah, quick little tutorial guide on heals and stuff like that, we're actually going to use this on our pistol. Righteous, righteous. We gotta keep our equipment in tip-top shape. <clears throat> Especially for early game, because if we let it get too low, that's uh, it's gonna be a very bad time. Yeah, we can keep that armor plate in there. Oh, cool. Okay. So, now we are going to save. And now we head up to the meadow. Oh, excuse me. I'm hiccuping and burping at the same time. It's not a good feeling. Alright, so... We'll grab the stash up in the meadow, and then come back to the farm, 
grab all of our mutant parts and then head up to the garbage to sell our mutant parts and then to complete our quests that we have up there so we can get the uh, cash flowing you know what I'm saying you know what I'm saying you're picking up what I'm laying down oh it is getting dark that is not good we have uh, no light sources well, we have glow sticks, but those aren't very good light sources. So, we gotta... Grab the stash quick and head back. Because nighttime is gonna be... Rough for us. I'm really happy I uh, fixed that crashing issue. Because that would have uh, caused me quite a bit of problems in the future. And I'm happy that I was smart enough to figure it out on my own. I went to the Stalker Gamma Discord to see if anybody had a solution for the problem. And uh, I just got too impatient and just said, F it, I'll figure it out on my own. So, But they're usually pretty good about getting back to you within a reasonable amount of time and uh, helping you with any issues that you guys may have. Oh, uh, there's a fucking poltergeist in there. Please don't come back towards me. Please don't come back towards me. Tommy gun. I'll just assemble that. Grab the parts from it. Not a great stash. Not a great stash. Ow. Please don't hit me. Like we are uh, full healing. So that's some bullshit. So, for those of you who don't know, do you ever see a floating electro moving around like that one? Shit. It is a poltergeist. And those things will lift up objects and throw them at you. Uh, the only way that you can really counteract that is just by crouching and not moving. Pretty much just want to not let it know that you're here, basically. You can kill them just by shooting at the center of them. But I really don't want to waste the ammo right now to try to do that. But, uh, yeah. Nice little tip for you guys when you're exploring. So, if you are out exploring in the zone and your screen gets really blue, you now know what to do. And I don't know why that poltergeist isn't effing off. We're just gonna run for it. F it, dude. F it. This is not going well. <laughs> Popping another heal. And using our last ibuprofen. I really, really don't want to. I don't have anything else. For my arms. 
Oh, that's so annoying. Ooh. Free artifact? We'll take those. We will take those. Oh, dude. That pulse blinded me. And I couldn't see that I was running straight into an anomaly. That's awesome. That's so righteous. So righteous. Ugh. I also don't know how long I'll make these episodes. We'll just have to see how I feel. Uh, we're probably gonna cut this episode pretty soon. Because uh, I am very tired. And I've been trying to figure this thing out all day. This is actually pretty interesting. We don't have a belt slot yet. We might save this. Alright, we're gonna drink and eat real quick. Our left arm is gonna be effed up for a while. Might just say F it. Take some sleeping pills and sleep. Because, another fun fact, if you sleep, it'll fully recover your limbs. So, having sleeping pills on hand is very good. If you're not wanting to waste meds, like I did. Because I completely forgot I had sleeping pills. So yeah, no don't... Idiot. Don't be like me. Be better than me, okay? We're gonna save. We're gonna put that in there. Put that, that. Put those in there. All that in there, that in there. Sell the rest of this stuff. Pick up all these mutant parts. Pop some sleeping pills. What the hell? Oh. Pop some sleeping pills to catch some Z's. And, uh... We'll move on out. Hearing my dude yawn just made me extra tired. <laughs> oh, I'm ready for bed. I slept for 15 hours, God bless. Alright, so let's drink and eat, and then we'll be on our way. Oh yeah, you eat those tomatoes, dude. Oh yeah, righteous, righteous, yum, yum, yum. Yum, 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 yum. I'm not a big fan of tomatoes. But, I'm happy that my guy is not a picky eater. Because then we would uh, definitely be in trouble. That's some random 5.56, five, dude. Sheesh, we will take that. It is very good to loot buildings and whatnot. Because they will also have some items for you. They won't always have them. And, I don't believe they respawn once you pick them up. But I'm not too sure, so. I'm still hungry, no shot. Oh. Mm. How much money do we have? Oh, we have 6k, bro. We can buy some stuff. Let's grab some ammo. Or do we buy a headlamp? Oh, we can't buy a headlamp. We're too broke for that. Uh, yeah, ammo. Ammo will be the way to go. 45. Let's buy some food as well. 
Cool. Back to being broke. Yeah, I know, I know. Relax. We got some fighting going on over there. The southwest, I think. I don't know. That might be north. Probably up at the checkpoint. Did I save? I'm gonna save real quick. Yeah, you guys will learn very quickly that I forget if I saved or not. You guys are just gonna have to bear with me, okay? Whenever I'm playing this mod, I am thinking about 15 different things. And saving... Oh! Oh no! Oh, those are flushes. We're good. We're going after J. We gotta reposition. This is a bad spot. Tree, save me. Where did that shot come from? It came from this house. I don't even know if it was directed at me. Could have been shooting at that flesh. Ah. Uh, I'm gonna switch to semi auto. Move up little by little and pray. I hear the shotgun to my left. That's a bandit for sure. Hit him once. Not the smartest idea of me just moving out in the open like this. SMG, probably, probably a scorpion or something. An old headlamp, too bad we can't repair this. Oh, God. That was really close. That's another bandit. He is shooting straight at me. Hit him once. Can I get on top of this? Oh, sh whatever. Oh my god, I'm I'm picking this fight all wrong. There's just so many bushes in the way. He just let off. I don't know if he's just letting off both of his barrels or if there's two people here. Bruh. Could you stop? Why don't you shoot at that flesh? Or flesh, why don't you help me out? Give me some backup here. This guy moving up. I think he's down. I can't tell. No, he's not. Damn. 
There is a guy very close to us, though. I'm, I'm trying to get an angle on this guy. He's just making this really tough. And he's got the major advantage with that shotgun. There's two of them now. How the hell did he get up here? What the hell? Other guy still close. I'm playing this very stupid. What the hell? Where did he come from? I think that's both of them. Dude, what is going on? These are teleporting dudes from- Oh! We're good. We're good. <laughs> uh, a bunch of junk. Oh my goodness gracious me. I'm too tired to deal with this shit, bros. <laughs> you guys can't be doing this to me. Oh. oh, okay. That's just righteous. Okay, what did you have? Dirty bolt carrier, huh? You guys field strip that. Nice. Cool, cool. There's some more vodka. Ooh, ooh. Alrighty. Little low on ammo. A little low on ammo. Just a little bit. Not much, though. Ah, it's just a flesh. Fleshes are easy to deal with because all you gotta do is look at them and they'll F off. They won't really mess with you, thank god. Alrighty. After all of that, we're finally heading up to the garbage. Sheesh, that's Christ. Oh god, here we go. Now we got fighting up here too, god bless. Save real quick. Try to get up here quick so I can help whoever is not my enemy. Blast that he's eating shots. Oh my god, we're out of ammo. Oh, we're jammed. No way, you're not dying. We're backing up. Bleeding. Got a bandage up. Dude. Jammed again. God bless. He's finally down. Oh my god, thank god. I got another guy looking at me though. We got two more guys looking at me? No way. Oh wait, oh wait. Oh my god. Damned again, we're good though. I think that's it. I'm praying that's it. We'll loot these guys in a second. somewhere I don't know exactly where nice he got him well done oh that's his loot okay 
That's his loot too. Well, guess what? These two out here are not yours. Oh my god! Oh. oh, I'm going through it this playthrough, man. I oh dude, I should have just went to bed. Oh, I still have ibuprofen. No way. Oh, dude, clutch the clutch gods. Oh, my saving grace, thank you. We gotta eat and drink desperately. God bless, dude. Oh, man. I will say I've never had a real, I've never had an encounter going from the farm up to the village where it's been this chaotic. Jeez Louise. What do you got? You can take those two, take that, take all that. We're still hungry somehow. Oh, that's a pretty nice helmet. That is a pretty nice helmet. God, it is effed up beyond belief, though. We are going to take that, though. We'll take that and that. SKS, that's busted up. We're good there. Well, we have successfully used up all of our FMJ ammo. Which is not cash money. Both of them, dude. What a prick. Couldn't, couldn't like leave anything for me, dude. I helped you out. I took out two of those dudes for you. Speaking of which, these bandits are extremely geared for some reason. What the heck is this? What is that about? I have never seen bandits geared like that. That is crazy. Should have, I should have been leg metting, metting them those, them dudes. Dude, I cannot talk right now. This sleepiness is getting to me, guys. So you guys are gonna hear a lot of stuff that doesn't make sense. So feel free to make fun of me down in the comments, and let me know what's your favorite random quote that I say is. Because I'm sure I've already said a few stupid things that don't make sense. All right. Where'd the second one go? Okay. Oh, this radiation's killing me. <laughs> place for a radiation zone to be okay so we have a stash right outside of there which is nice I gotta go over there deal with that shit we got two traders right there which is weird I've never seen that before okay oh they're freedom thank god I was not ready to get into another fight right now. I am very low on ammo, and I am still hungry. My dude is such a POS. Hopefully I'm able to get a good amount of change from selling all these mutant parts. I heard a dog to my right. I don't want to deal with it. Somebody's shooting at it. Please be a good guy. That's friendly towards my faction right. lots of shooting behind the hangar not cash money at all where's the stash it's inside I'm bugging
We got duty posted up here. That's cool. Am I overweight? No. Hell, it's taking my stamina down. Oh, that's probably because I'm dying of hunger. Where's that chocolate bar? Dude, why am I so hungry? All right, I might need it. Take a second to see how to cook at campfires, cause I, I need I need a I need to make some food. Cause this is not good at all. Like that. Save. Yes, I know you're hungry. I get I get it, my guy. You're just gonna have to Bear with me for a little bit, please. Might have to stash some stuff here as well. Uh, we can just assemble that. It's fine. We'll just put that ammo in there for right now. That in there. What is up, my friend? So we can sell all of this to you. Nice, righteous. And we'll sell that to you. And we'll hold on to that. Some other traders will pay better money for that stuff. And we will buy some more hollow points, I think. Righteous, righteous. Okay. Alright. How does I... That is not what I wanted to do at all. Alright. I'm going to reload that save because that is BS. <laughs> I will not be reloading saves often, but if I do something extremely stupid like that, I am going to re I'm going to reload my save. some more ammo again and cool, cool. Uh, there's usually some stuff down here in the bottom left that we can grab hopefully food is in that category we got another protein bar and that is it wow we got cooked um check the settings see how this thing works and then I will uh, hopefully be back with uh, the solution all right we are back and we have made a discovery we need a, uh, a cooking kit in order to uh, make this so that makes sense that makes sense uh... AK, oh boys, we're not in a good spot at all. God bless my soul, man. God bless my soul. This is bad. This is, this is a bad time. Yes, I know. I know. We're just going to have to pray, essentially. We are also going to have to head towards these traders and pray to God that they are selling some food. We're probably going to have to sell some stuff we don't want to sell, but I mean, 
You gotta make sacrifices sometimes. I swear to God, Flesh, you better back up. I don't have time to deal with you right now. Alright, a flea market. It has been a while. There are a bunch of dead guys here. This is concerning. Oh. Oh. We're taking that AK. We're taking that too. Oh, look at that. My bad, my bad, my bad, my bad. My bad. Alright, there should be a trader up here in the corner, yeah. Sitting by his lonesome. Okay, food, food, you have to have food. You do, you're so righteous. 800, I don't have enough. 450 for that, sure. You can have both of those. Uh, God bless. Uh... Yeah, you can have that, you can have that, you can have that, 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 that. Oh, I really don't want to sell these, but I might have to. Oh, I have to, I'm getting 2k from all that stuff, dude. Shh, we're fine, we're vibing. Uh, 114. We'll just buy one of those. Yeah, I know, I know. Just give me a second, please. Alright. Now, we're going to sell just a bit more. We are going to sell those two. So that we can buy one of those. Okay. Alrighty. We have uh, dodged a major bullet there. We're going to sit here and queue up, and then we're going to go and... What do we got to do? I got to clear the research area, and then I got to save one of the ecologists being held up there hostage. So we're pretty much killing two birds with one stone. And then we'll go turn all that stuff in, and I think we will call it for this video. And I'm already hungry, dude. Well, time to use this food now. Righteous, righteous, dude. God bless my soul. Uh, our ammo is not good. I think we only have follow points. So that's not great. But we're going to save here and just go in for it. We're not going to wait to get fully healed because then we're just wasting time because our... Food is just going to continuously drop, and we don't have the money to keep it sustained, or the resources to keep it sustained right now. We have 6 FMJ, a lot of hollow points, and 9 AP rounds. I think I just loaded AP rounds. We did. Alright. We got 9 shots. 9 opportunities to make this happen. And to get through this as quickly and, and as efficiently as possible. Creep up to these logs, get a better angle on what the situation is. We got one bandit there. Please die with this first shot. Bruh. Oh, that was it. Righteous. Uh, you did not have Jack except for that. Come with me if you want to leave. Okay. So, now I gotta take this dude all the way back to... There. So we got quite the journey ahead of us. 
Drink some vodka real quick. Get rid of some of this radiation. I'm gonna come up here and save again real quick. Save, righteous, cool. Now we head back down. And there is a stash in that little uh, area. Whenever we are going to and from the garbage to Corden, so. Bro, I don't have time for you to be practicing your shot on that flesh bro okay we gotta go can i loot these i can righteous 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 <laughs> change your plans again we're selling all this mutant stuff <laughs> we might as well I swear to God, if that dude dies because he's effing around, I'm gonna be upset. I'm gonna be very upset. All right, so you can have all of that, and you can have all that. 15 hundo, I'll take it. I will take it. We're gonna save again. That's not sounding good. What's going on? Nothing's going on. You're just tweaking out, dude. I need you to keep it together, okay? Keep it together for me, please. The sleepiness inside of me is growing. The hunger is going to start setting in again. And I am not ready for it to. What the hell? Oh, it's a zombie. That's fine. We can deal with zombies. Zombies are easy mode. Zombies are easy mode. If you ever wonder why the search and rescue mission keeps updating, it is because it will keep resetting itself whenever this dude is too far from me. And then whenever he gets in close proximity it'll pop up the notification again it's unnecessary but it is what it is you know what i'm saying it is what it is no biggie smalls all righty we'll check the stash pray that bandits have not taken over this outpost while we've been gone which i don't think they have but we're just gonna have to come in here and be prepared. Oh god, it's military. Wow. Should have been using hollow points on these guys the whole time, dude. What the hell? Oh. We're taking that. We got a car, dudes. Oh my god, dude. We are fucking. Oh my god. Uh, we will definitely take that barrel. That is for sure. <gasps> oh, that's big. That is big. What do you have? Nothing too crazy. We'll take your bolt carrier, though. And all your ammo. And a harmonica, dude. Oh, we're gonna be playing some tunes. Jamming out. Where are we at on weight? We'll just take the rest of that. Sell it. Oh. Oh, the barrel is aft on it, though, bros. Oh. 
we're getting rid of it. We just dismantle it, take the parts. Take your parts as well. It's easy money right there. Cut. Let's head out. This run is uh, getting pretty crazy with the loot. I like it. I dig it. Fortunately, we're not able to use most of it, but you know, it is what it is. It is what it is. At least we'll have the parts for future weapons that we may want to use. You know what I'm saying? That's the important thing. You got to think about the long run. You know what I'm saying? We won't be able to use uh, any of these parts right now, but what's my weapon condition? Ooh, we got to repair our armor at some point. Just the flesh reviving. Fleshes won't attack you if they're alone. If they're in a pack, though, yeah, they'll they'll try to gangbang you. But once they notice that their numbers are down, they'll start fleeing. They'll even flee if you just look at them in the eyes. They'll just get scared, I guess, get nervous under the pressure, and just dip out. Right. What up, what up, dude? Alright, let's offload some stuff. Uh, we might just dismantle. Yeah, that. Uh, we'll keep that pistol for now and dismantle that. Put a lot of this stuff in there. That in there, that in there, that in there. Got a lot of this ammo in there. All that, 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 that stuff. That in there. All that in there, that in there. Did not want to put that in there. We'll put that in there. And I think that is it. I think we're pretty much chilling now. Uh, we are going to take that out and use it on this bad boy. So some of these items, as you can see in the properties, it will give you a repair bonus, so it will add more to the repairs which is nice cool I don't know what is with this music but Jesus Christ okay so all of that for 900 we won't be getting too much out of it, but it is what it is. You know what I'm saying? It is what it is. Uh, I need to save up so I can start making some stuff. I'm gonna need to make this one I believe 
I need to find basic pools. That's gonna be a pain in the ass. That's right, that's right. Alright. Let's light this fire. Save. Drink some agua. Yeah, Tell our dude to wait there so he doesn't get stuck anywhere. Three, forty. Damn. I'm barely short. Shit. I need to sell something. I don't think that harmonica will get me enough now. All right, hold on, hold on. If we can get that cooking kit, we will be in a very good position. I might have to just sell this artifact. Seven hundred, that'll be enough. And we'll buy that. Righteous, 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 righteous. Okay, so now we need that, and that, and all of that, okay, and now we use that, liquid fuel, oh, I need the liquid fuel for that stuff. Damn it. What if we use it now? I have liquid fuel. What do you mean? Oh my god. Oh. Okay. Sorry, I was sneezing. Sorry, sorry. Alright. Why is this stuck now? This thing really bugged right now. It's really bugged right now. This is crazy. This is crazy. I'm gonna have to reload my save. All right. Two seconds. <laughs> ay, 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 ay. This run is, uh, This run is making me feel like an emotional roller coaster right now. I tell you what, I tell you what. I did not mean to sell those bolts, but whatever. We'll find more. Alright, so this one. That's 15k for that. Ay, ay, ay. I could probably wait. But I don't want to. I really don't want to. Alright, so. We will just grab all this food. And we will make some stuff. Righteous, righteous. Alright. Those will give us radiation, but not nearly as much as the rest of them, so. Cool. Awesome. That means now we're going to be low on water. But, 
Once we turn this quest in, I forgot to save. Once we turn this quest in, we should have enough to grab a bit more water. And then we'll be set. Oh my gosh. I completely forgot about the emission storm happening. So for those of you who don't know, mission storms will periodically happen throughout the game. When they happen, radiation zones, anomalies, and stuff like that will sometimes, not all the time, but they will sometimes move. So how that anomaly is there right now, when an emission storm next passes through it could be in front of that farm or it could be in the middle of this road or it could be over there it could be anywhere and it doesn't happen all the time but it does happen so it's very good to uh, pay attention when emission storms happen and whatnot but the only anomalies or the only yeah the only anomalies that don't really move are these two on the bridge There'll always be one right there, about the halfway point, and there'll be... Okay. Alright. Yeah, that's what you get. Oh my gosh. That's my fault for being an idiot. I'm just dumb. I did, uh, I'm just turning in this quest and calling it. This is... Aw, oh, this is crazy. My brain is ceasing to function the longer I play this. Oh, this is tough, titties. We made it back. We made it back. <sighs> I really hope this is this place I was supposed to take jobs done. It was sick. I got morphine from that guy. Sick. What the hell? Is it this guy? Yeah, that's this guy. 6k. Nice. Righteous. Made a quick 11k from that. Not too bad. And I got another quest over here to turn in, which is even more fantastic. 42k. Beautiful. Check the task board real quick. See what people want. Lost signal. Jupiter. Yeah, F off. We could do that. We could do that. Stash in the gray swamps. Yeesh. We can do that. We can do that. And I guess we'll go grab that stash. Might as well. Bandit faction patches. We can do that. And okay. Cool. We'll buy some stuff real quick. We have 16k. We will buy water. We will buy some more med kits. Buy some ibuprofen. And buy another bandage. Yeah, this is gonna have to be it right here. Damn. Ah, wasn't realizing how low I was on a uh, meds. Shit. I was really hoping to buy a, a headlamp. Unfortunate. All good. Okay. All right. Ammo is still pretty low. I don't think we can buy any. Uh, we could buy some FMJ. Only 15 though, it's not really worth it. Okay. 
All right. We are going to pop some sleeping pills. Sleep. Save. And call it. I think. It has been a crazy, crazy, crazy first episode. But overall, it has been a blast, even though I am having a hard time keeping my eyes open. I've had a bell I've had a blast playing. And I cannot wait to continue it for the next episode. <sighs> to sleep until four it's probably gonna be bad but it is what it is okay we need to eat and drink Another one of these. Drink some water. Drink one more swig of water. And then save. And then turn in these quests. <laughs> Even though I said I was gonna <sighs> end. Nice, nice, nice. Okay. I'm just gonna buy a few more things. And then we will save and call it, I swear. <laughs> okay. We have 8k to work with. We are down on food again. I really, really wanna buy this headlamp, but we gotta have priorities. We'll buy three of these sausages, I think. Down 2k. Damn. Buy 30 rounds of FMJ. And then go and save. And then we will be good. Alrighty. And that is it. That is our first episode of our stalker gamma series hope you guys enjoyed it i hope you guys uh will enjoy this series i think you guys will even though i have low energy right now i won't always have low en low energy when i play this so i'll definitely be more pepped up and ready to go <laughs> but uh yeah let me know what you guys uh, are thinking of the game so far. Uh, this is Stalker Gamma. It is a standalone free mod to play. Uh, it's a very, very easy install. It does take a bit of space, so make sure you have space on your drives to, you know, install it. <laughs> Again, also, this is a PC only mod, so. There you go. But if you've never played Stalker or you have played Stalker and you've never played Gamma, I definitely definitely recommend you give it a go. Even though it is tough, once you get the hang of things, it's it's very fun and it's a very great time. Trust. Or if you guys just want to keep watching me play, so you guys can get a better feel for the game and whatnot. That is cool too. Uh, if there are any little things that you guys want to see or any questions you guys have, put them down in the comments below. 
and I'll do my best to answer any questions or if you guys have anything you want me to go for I'll be sure to you know make a side note of it and do my best to achieve that goal in a future episode but uh till then hope you guys have a great rest of your day and I'll see you in the next episode peace